Hello guys, welcome to Watchipo. My name is Hakim. So today we'll review this watch in front of us right now. The Seiko Turtle Special Edition Paddy version uh, SRPA 21K. For returning subscriber, thank you very much. For those who are new to this channel, welcome and thank you. This channel is mainly about affordable watches. So if you maybe accidentally clicking thumbnail to look something like this, I appreciate if you subscribe to this channel. This watch is loaned to me by Nur Muhammad from NM Watch. So I will leave a link below uh, to his channel. This watch is the iconic turtle style case, turtle ca uh, cushion case, cushion case. <laughs> Sorry, cushion case shape uh, watch, uh, very retro, retro, what you call it? retro style watch, and a very classy looking, and quite large actually. By the looking, you look it very large, but when you wear actually, uh, it's it's still wearable actually. You can get this watch around. 550 to 400 maybe USD uh, uh, in ring Malaysia usually around 2000 to 2500 ring Malaysia I get to wear this watch around quite a lot of time quite uh, around one what one to two weeks wearing this watch before I also have turtle style watch here you see the Seiko, but it's actually a modded watch uh, from Heimdalla. Later, I will give you some comparison with this watch. Without further ado, let's go to the spec of this watch. The case diameter is 45mm. Plus crown here is 46.5mm. If you measure from this end of bezel to this end of bezel only, it is around 42.5 mm. Thickness is around 13 mm. Lug to lug is around 47.5 mm. And lug width is around 22 mm. With this strap, the watch weight is around 115 grams. And this watch is a water resistant, diverse water resistant, 200 meters. Uh, and the crystal is just hard like crystal. So let's have a look to the dials. The dial here is blue colored dial. Have slight sunburst there. So you can play it a little bit and you can see the sunburst there. All the indices is applied. And there are also they did complication there. It it's not frame but what you call it? there are some slope there to what you call it? to make it look as a frame but physically there is no border there. Maybe I just move it a little bit so you can see there. So the Seiko X Paddy automatic divers 200 meter all is printed and uh, to be honest it is quite cluttered there. Normally if this watch is not a Paddy version the X logo prospect logo there will be at the Paddy location. So the hands here uh, same as other turtles or should we say same as the escape also. But the difference is they play with the minute hands there to give it a red frame there, which is the theme of all Paddy's watch. They have the Pepsi color there. They have red and blue. Also the blue chaptering. The blue chaptering also is nicely done. And there is also red accent on every five minutes okay the bezel here the action is 
standard Seiko, smooth bezel action, not much click there, but very firm, little back play or almost no back play. Quite line, mm, slightly not line, but no problem. This is Seiko. <laughs> And the insert is aluminum bezel insert. As you can see, the owners of this watch really use this watch properly. There are some scratch there, but not a problem. And the uh, bezel is coin edge bezel, double coin edge bezel for easy grip. All the action for the Seiko bezel is very, very nice. line not quite but liner okay let's look to the case this is where the watch shines to many people this cushion case which is uh, very large very nice and very retro looking the upper is brush circular brush here and very nice from Seiko, the circular brush with the what call it, the dented here for easy easy to operate the crown and the side is polish the side is polish for those who don't know maybe also if I'm mistaken please correct me in the comment I think this Seiko model from the 6309 is what makes the Seiko SKX now. They work, uh, trim the size of the turtle to become the SKX now. So much of the design slope here is you can found in the SKX also. Now at a glance you can see the theme of this watch. It is a if without paddy also we you can know this this is this is the what you call, uh, a Pepsi style watch which also good I'm a fan of it I really love the Pepsi style okay the crown here is easy to use uh, this watch is uh, hand winding there are two position here for setting date and for setting time and as you can see here it is hacking of course this watch using the Seiko 4R35, I'm oh sorry, 4R36 movement, the day date version of the 4R35. Uh, the equivalent of this movement, as you know, also the NH35. I will write the spec on this side, spec of movement for those who want to know. Uh, reliable movement, anything that you need from, from a watch below 500. Okay, the back case here, typical Seiko with the addition of the special edition there with the nice, the nice textured uh, Kanagawa waves, Seiko wave medallion here and the Prospect logo, really, really nice. This is brush and the whole case here is polish. Okay, the loom here, again. A very nice Seiko loom, Domi bright, really, really bright, really, really useful. Typical Seiko. Uh. What, what should we expect? This is the what. This is why we love Seiko. The loom is so bright. Uh, to compare here, I bring my samurai here. Give it a charge a little bit again. Again. Both is bright. There are two outside they want to join us also, so <laughs> we just give some flash here. <laughs> okay. Really, really nice look. Okay, I brought here my Seiko SK here. So here, when I say the finishing is around the same, here what I mean very circular finishing very nice and quite identical actually from the side 
but obviously at this area already different but this part is quite the same they say this this model is actually roots from this model so you know uh, why it looks similar at this side and also here to compare with my modded hem dollar turtle this watch i own for around five months right now really really, really nice watch i should so I should make the video before I modded this watch, but never mind. Already modded <laughs> with this orange dial. On a glance, it looks same, but you can notice right now the difference. First, the crown here. Obviously, the crown on the Seiko Turtle is uh, what call it? easier to use because there are some grooves there. While this is not having the finishing on the side. It's quite the same actually, but you can see here is smoother. Uh, the original is better. Here you can see the different from this part to the, this part. You can see a line, while this not you can you cannot see at all. And the finishing on the lugs, Heimdaller is sharp, not so sharp, not sharp but it's uh, shaping to become sharp but this is round round shape here and this is sharp side by side here you can see there this is quite kind of sharp but not that sharp still okay but here very smooth others oh, of course this already glass glass sapphire ceramic bezel okay here how it's look on my wrist indeed it is very very nice my wrist is around 20-21 cm so quite a large wrist and this watch really fits me really well I just love the look of this watch. Okay, what I love about this watch. First of all, the, the look of it. Look at it. <laughs> really, really cool. What I call a retro style cushion case watch. And I enjoy it actually. As much I enjoy this one. Obviously, the original is better, right? This one, the Hamdala, will not come without this original. What a lovely design. And the best part of it is they keep the same price, affordable, until this time, until this date. Uh, if you want to most the, go to the most basic SRP777, also you can got it, got it in very nice price, around $250 to $400 you can, you can get it. Uh, this one obviously a Seiko party version so special edition the price is slightly increased ah. and this watch is really really comfortable on your wrist despite the size of this watch okay, what that I not so keen about it, about this watch well basically nothing but if I want to improve first maybe if this watch is mine maybe at some point I will change the the what call it? the hard legs to sapphire and at some point maybe after this aluminum bezel scratch badly I will change it to the ceramic bezel other than that I think it's very good and about the preference I own this watch for around one year right now. From the from the time I'm choosing the watch, I actually not love. I actually really don't care about the turtle. So I really love the samurai. And after I try it, at the end I still love the samurai. <laughs> so 
in the end, it is a preference uh, whether which one you want to wear. So thank you very much, uh, Noor, for lending me this watch. Will I get myself to get a real one instead of this Heimdallah turtle? I think not. At the end, it will depend on your preference, and I think I will not spend. I will not spend around 250 to to 300 US dollar for Seiko Turtle, for in my opinion. But that's just my opinion. This is a great watch. And if you enjoy the looks, you should buy. Okay, if you enjoy this video, please like and comment. And if you still not subscribe to this channel, please subscribe. So that's all for today. Thank you very much. Again, please like, comment and subscribe. And see you again in the next video. Thank you very much. Ciao.